piece for uh, Mima was uh, originally exhibited in, in Times Square. It was like a product of that place. You know, that was exactly what Times Square has always been about. This giant celebration <laughs> of commerce in, in a way that is uh, completely unholy. All the religious people going around and uh, topless women in Elmo's and just this weird hybriding of like all this clash of culture that's kind of what the wheel was about. And then to see this big sacred object sort of form together through what all that represents and become this cohesive whole that somebody can actually think about in a different way. Um, once you take it out of Times Square and you present it in a different light, I think people get to see that as an artifact all of a sudden. And, and they get to appreciate it as the object that it is and what it's trying to say. 